Hello everyone and welcome back to our channel. Today, we are going to talk about one of the most famous rulers of ancient Egypt, King Khafre. Khafre was born in the 4th dynasty of Egypt, and he was the son of the famous pharaoh Khufu. Khafre was the second son of Khufu, and he was chosen to succeed his father as the next pharaoh of Egypt. Khafre was the son of King Khufu, who was also known as Cheops. Khafre was the 4th dynasty pharaoh of Egypt, and he ruled from approximately 2558 to 2532 BCE. He was the builder of the second largest pyramid at Giza, which is also known as the Pyramid of Khafre. The Pyramid of Khafre is one of the most remarkable structures of ancient Egypt. It was constructed over a period of 20 years and reaches a height of 143.5 meters. The building blocks used to construct the pyramid were enormous and weighed approximately 2.5 tons each. It is believed that the Pyramid of Khafre was originally covered in white limestone, but much of it has since been removed. The Pyramid of Khafre was built over a 20-year period, and it stands at a height of 143.5 meters. The blocks used to construct the pyramid weigh an average of 2.5 tons. It is believed that the pyramid was originally covered in white limestone, which has since been removed. King Khafre left behind a strong legacy as one of the most innovative and visionary pharaohs of Egypt. He is credited with building several important structures, including the Pyramid of Khafre and the Great Sphinx. Khafre is also known for establishing a strong central government and expanding Egypt's trade networks with neighboring countries, including Syria and Libya. Another famous monument that is associated with King Khafre is the Great Sphinx. This is a statue that has the body of a lion and the head of a human, believed to be that of King Khafre. The Sphinx sits beside the Pyramid of Khafre, and it is one of the most recognizable symbols of ancient Egypt. During his reign, Khafre was known for his building projects and for establishing a strong central government. He also expanded Egypt's trade network with neighboring countries such as Syria and Libya. King Khafre was an important figure in ancient Egyptian history, and his legacy lives on to this day. His contributions to Egypt's culture and society are numerous, and his engineering feats are still studied and celebrated by people around the world. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more fascinating content on ancient history. King Khafre was an important figure in ancient Egyptian history, and his legacy lives on to this day. His contributions to Egypt's culture and society are numerous, and his engineering feats are still studied and celebrated by people around the world. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more fascinating content on ancient history. King Khafre was an important figure in ancient Egyptian history, and his legacy lives on to this day. His contributions to Egypt's culture and society are numerous, and his engineering feats are still studied and celebrated by people around the world. Thank you for watching, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more fascinating content on ancient history. King Khafre was an important figure in ancient Egyptian history, and his legacy lives on to this day. His contributions to Egypt's culture and society are numerous, and his engineering feats are still studied and celebrated by people around the world. Before we conclude we would like to inform all followers about the competition, 10 participants will be randomly selected on an antique coin, Egyptian pound, provided that a subscription. So, that's a brief overview of King Khafre, his legacy, and his famous monuments. Although much remains unknown about his life and reign, his impact on ancient Egypt is still felt today. We hope you enjoyed this video, and don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe to our channel for more videos on ancient history. Thank you for watching.